In the last episode, Ras got discovered by Gambi, you know. Gambi's daughter found a mask in uh, in Ras's car. So now we know, or oh, we strongly, very strongly suspect, almost certainly, is the number one suspect for who shot Gambi, you know. But it also wouldn't surprise me if, if Ras or somehow as an an excuse that's somehow good enough to make Gambi go yeah, yeah i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry for accusing you you're my only friend man didn't mean to accuse you of something so 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 fucking horrific i'm sorry i'm sorry <laughs> we've seen that happen before you know i've seen it happen before uh russ has done something really fucked up or really manipulative and then when confronted by Gambi, he somehow you know he fakes vulnerability you know he's a master at that man He's very good at making you feel sorry for him when he, when he needs you to. So let's see how he maneuvers through this, man. The title of the episode is Venetian Night. But then it could also be, maybe it's not even Russell, man. Maybe it's, maybe it's Abbott. And, my, and maybe that's why she was there, man. Maybe she came by to drop the, the evidence to frame Russell, man, because he saw that he saw that Gambi was taking Russell to spring break instead of her. Like he was prioritizing, him. she was he was prioritizing him ahead of her. That clearly played out and registered to her. So maybe she's the one who shot him. Maybe she's she just came by to to plant that evidence and create that that clash between um, Gambi. And Russ seems, seems, since he seems to care so much about Russ more than her. The HSAP test results are in. It's great. 98th percentile English, 99th percentile math. Thank you. I would like to share this moment with some teachers who came up with their own very, very special ways of helping me out. For all your help with our HSAP success, I want to honor you. These are my gold star teachers! No, no. You fucking wear it. This is a very, very uh, unexpected move by Russ, man. You know, I like what he's doing here, man. You know, I like the approach. It's the obvious approach. Our gold star teachers will now be available to all of our students 24-7. We are! <laughs> and hear us! <laughs> so tell me, Russell. Do you feel bad about shooting me? Do I feel bad about what? To act this time, man. I found the shooter's mask in your Jeep. You hid it in your wife's truck, you fucking coward. Like a Halloween mask? A shooter's mask, you motherfucker. Come on, Gabby. If your resignation is not on Haas's desk by first thing in the morning, I will fucking shoot you. Damn move. Stupid Gambi move. Typical stupid Gambi. Stupid emotional move by, by Gambi, man. Why would you give him a chance to come up with a plan? He's going to go and he's going to come up with come back with a gun and probably shoot you man again you know you deserve to get shot for being so dumb right now gambi stupid if you're not gonna shoot me now do you mind getting that gun out of my fucking face what if you shoot me in the back as i'm walking away because i'm going to shoot you fucking tomorrow morning not a moment sooner you're making a big mistake you're not in control russell yeah but you're giving you're giving him a chance to gain control man do it now if you're sure do it now Maybe that maybe doesn't want to be a murderer himself. So they're just shady people. Something like this, if you're Gambi, a normal civilian would probably go to the police and say, hey man, the guy the guy I got shot a few months ago, or maybe a year ago. You know, and I found the mask of the shooter in uh, this guy that in this guy's jeep, this guy that I work with. But then Gambi risks They've done a lot of that together. So if he does that, he'll definitely like incriminate himself because Russell has a lot to say. All the horrendous, terrible stuff, it's finally done. My case is solved. Cops didn't catch shit. I caught him and I dealt with him. Wait, it's a him? Were we ever in danger, Gabby? Oh, yes, Ray, we were. Every fucking day of our lives. Russell is not showing up today, okay? Are you sure? Ah, there he is. Oh, 
Well, I'm here for work, dummy. I'm the boss. Blossoming! I told you what would happen if you came back here. Oh, are you gonna kill me? Get real. I'm a man to be feared, you son of a bitch. Because of the way you're acting, you're a man to be laughed at. Fuck! My shooter has revealed himself, and he is none other than Lee Russell. And you should know that I have a firearm if we need it. You brought a gun to school. God damn it, Willows. Don't start doing your job now. You feeling all right, Gamby? I want to be honest with you about something. Okay, honesty's good. Lee and I burned down Belinda Brown's house, and then we blackmailed her, and we forced her out of her job, and we basically destroyed her whole entire life, and then Lee shot me. Holy fuck. I'm going to fix all the terrible shit that I've done, okay? Are you? You burned Dr. Brown's house down? The important crime here is that someone I trusted shot me. You motherfucker, Gamby. This is because of you. I will take everything from you, everything we've built. I will fucking destroy you. Everyone stop what you're doing. I have a revelation that is going to rock you. He was never part of our group. What in the hell, Gamby? You sold us out to your BFF? I'm working on a plan right now to topple him once and for all. Backstabbing prick. Nobody likes you again. Does that feel familiar? Nothing I ever did here was ever not in the best interest of North Jackson High School. You'll see. I'll show you all. Let's go, man. Newspaper story went well. I think they'll write something nice. You're forcing my fucking hand. Pull the trigger. Fuck. You don't have the fucking balls to go to war with me. So you're fired. You just tried to fucking kill me, Gamby. Well, you tried to kill me first. Get out. Get out. Fuck out. Get out! You're being punked, man. Good day, Tigers. What a wonderful day it is to be a Tiger. Thank you. Certainly, we can phase out ordering in the hallways. So thank you very, very much for this. Neil Gamby, what are you doing? Here? Still has beef with Gamby, man. Freeze, Gamby. Oh. He is no longer the boy of North Jackson High School. He is nothing. You take him out front. I want everyone to no. see it. Your gate was open. Yeah, no duh. Disabled all my security perimeter. What happened? I was fired. Whatever. Say la vie. What, did you come here to make fun of me? No, I'm... Maybe this will be my new life. You know, I'll just play pickup games for money. What I did for Lee... <sighs> That's the reason why I didn't talk to you after the shooting. I was ashamed of who I'd become. You know, when you read my book, you were the only person who believed in me. I believe in you, too. I believe that you're a good person and that your heart is in the right place. This is in my mailbox. It's all my fault. I have to stop them. I make this shot, you may come with. Did I do it? You did. But I found out that Lee Russell tried to murder me. Anything is possible with him, I guess. I know he's caused you a lot of pain. Those lies he spread about your ex-boyfriend. I'm sure there's some level of abuse going on as well. Because if there was something, we could just report him to Haas and... Lee! She's saying to take you to his hiding place. I like to keep detailed records. It's like a serial killer storage unit. God, it smells like him too. Gross. Here it is. His sister's diary. Almost every entry is about Lee. His family knows who he is more than anyone. I think that's why he hates him. Bro, Lee is like... He's feeling like a... Like a serial killer character, man. Like a... He feels really scary right now. You know, it's terrifying right now, man. And you can see, you can feel it with the way they are, they 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 they're shooting this, the the music and stuff. It's like we're dealing with uh. Yeah, yeah, we've entered dangerous territory, man. We're dealing with a fucking viper here, man. Where the fuck are you taking us anyway? 
Stop complaining, Reggie. Right on time, Deshaun. This is a Gamby thing. I don't know about you guys, but I don't feel safe around this violent psychopath. Of course. Just let her go. It's fine. The reason why I brought all of you out here is because each of you represent the backbone of this school. North Jackson needs you. You and Lee are butt buddies. Who are you trying to kid? Maybe Lee Russell is fucking Mr. Gamby. <laughs> <laughs> that don't mean he's not trying to help us. Well, it is time that lion sack of shit was taken the fuck down. Amen. Lee Russell never done anything to me, but I'll whip that skinny motherfucker's ass. Lee Russell's sister's diary. His secrets shall be weaponized. Ah, <laughs> oh, they're butt buddies. This is gonna be the go-to. This is how we do it, guys. I'm about to enter the belly of the beast and I'm not sure if I'm gonna make it out. So it's important for me to let the both of you know. Okay, I know you and I have never been on the same page, but without you, there would be no Janelle. It's fine, don't say something snide and ruin it. Okay, th thank you. I'll always be your dad and I'll always be with you, even if I get myself killed this evening. Ray, will you give me a ride to the prom? <laughs> Prom queen, may your life be a dream or a fucking nightmare. <laughs> no students allowed backstage, you know that. Just, just give me that. Oh, no wonder, Neil Gamby's boy. Uh, whoa, 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 open this fucking door. Greetings. Jesus fucking Christ. Face it, Gamby, I'm smarter than you. Whatever you say. You talked to Christine. She gave me a little tour of your hiding place. You fucker, that's private. Oh, I know it is. Very private. Get that fuck you. You had quite the colorful childhood, huh? Lee tied a cat up in a sack and drowned it in a pond. Now we call him the kitty killer till he cries. Game. Definitely a sociopath, man. Psychopath, sociopath, whatever it is. The last one. You know, dude was torturing and killing animals, man, you know. He's a, a serial killer who maybe, he's probably killed, killed several people if you actually think about it, man. You know. Him shooting Gambi was such a fucking crazy move. It suggests that maybe he's done it before to other people. And then there's this one, of course. Me and my sister were spying on Lee in the bathroom. We caught him standing on the bathroom sink, inspecting his own asshole in the mirror. The juicy stuff, that comes in the teen years. I totally understand. Just give it back to me, please. I'll forgive everything. My people have control of the PA system. The day Lee was kicked out of gymnastics. Don't! Don't! Read that. I never want to see your face again. It's over, Lee. The Gold Star teachers have given me an official recommendation to replace you. Is your resignation, which I have kindly filled out for you. Gambi is still being really dumb. This is not a matter of being principled, man. His ultimate revenge, ultimate get back seems to be unprincipled now. This guy tried to kill you, bro. You should be looking to get rid of this guy forever. You know, who's to say that he won't come back after he's already resigned and just shoot you in the parking lot again. You know, this guy shot you and your big revenge is being principal. Taking that from him, come on, man. Come on, man. This guy will come back and just kill you, man. You still think I'm not so smart? I beat you. It's over. He's gone. Another person with motive. Oh yeah, Gambi is definitely going to die. Abbott, Abbott has a motive. Lee has the biggest fuck, fucking motive out there. This guy's just... I like Gambi, he has a good heart, but he lacks... He's too soft. That's what's going to get him killed, man. He's moral sometimes, you know, he can't stand up for himself, but... When you're dealing with this caliber of... Opposition, you have to kill. You can't leave Lee Russell out there, man. You can't have Lee out there, man. It's just, you know, it's a ticking time bomb. You know? The guy shoots you, almost kills you. And your biggest fuck you to him is, I beat you. I'm principal now. <laughs> Come on. Also, Abbott, man. If Lee doesn't do it, Abbott will. Or they may, maybe they'll team up. Yeah. I feel like the next episode is going to be really... Shocking and sad for Gambi, you know, but, but he's redeemed himself, man. Yo, Russell, man, the guy portrait of a serial killer for real, man.
you know, he got kicked out of gymnastics. They didn't even tell us what he did. We were left to imagine. It, it being gymnastics and uh, considering the kind of creeps that gymnastics attracts, I'm, pr I'm thinking pro he probably did something really, really sexual. He probably exposed himself or something to the gymnastics team or maybe he assaulted someone sexually in the gymnastics team. You know? I thought his sisters were bullies, man. But they saw him for what he was. Even his dad, the way his dad would just be like, I think it was just disappointment from his dad because his dad also knew what he was, man. He knew like he had a psycho on his hands, you know, killing animals when he was young. His sisters knew like this guy is fucked up. You know, somehow he managed to get, get a hold of that diary, you know, <laughs> to, to kind of prevent that from coming out, man. You know, I want to read through that diary. I'm curious. I'll see you guys in the next episode, man. Peace.